I'm going to say hi and welcome. This is a message from Mother Mary for Divine Masculine. Who is the author of your words? Is it Satan or Jesus? This is only to default program if you don't choose Jesus is Satan. I looked under the cards after the Mother Mary message for Divine Feminine and found, I said, is there one for Divine Masculine? And I got Our Lady of Sacred Union. Because they're in grief energy and letting go of an old pattern that's been, um, you know, three generations worth can be. So welcome Twin Flames, we're in a stargate going through a flame eclipse, the highest vibration to ever hit the planet in the history of humanity is now those of you who are in um, alignment with your blueprint and have your rainbow body cleared through energy healing will be receiving the 144 configuration upgrade at this time so that means that everything starts shifting and changing mentally and emotionally and physically you can feel your body changing so being aware that you're the only one who can think inside your mind. We're mastering our emotions. It's self-mastery to become the diamond God made us to be. Message to Divine Masculine in this Stargate Flame Eclipse from Mother Mary. Our Lady of Sacred Union, there is a conflict occurring within you. And perhaps you see this reflected in your world. They are, they are warring opposites, trying to find a way to be together in peace. It is not because you are doing something wrong. It is because you are doing something right. You are growing. I will keep you safe. I will ensure you find the way by which all can function in harmony. Trust me as I guide you into sacred union within yourself and with the world around you. Do not give up, beloved. Harmony will find its way into your heart very soon. Sometimes choices need to be made between this way or that. Sometimes this is healthy and essential for our growth, yet there are times when a choice of inclusion, choosing both this way and that is the way through, which we can best grow. A choice of inclusion allows us to learn how to bring apparently opposing forces together into harmony within us and in our world. This might be showing up a completely internal issue for you. Perhaps you are dealing with conflicting desires for a family and love relationship and to feel safe and secure internally in that community. But at the same time you are longing for independence and freedom to explore and express yourself and your creativity in the world. Perhaps that inner struggle of coming together is far more subtle and difficult to pin down. A sense that you want to live your life lightly and with joy, but also that you really want to know and be who you are. To not hide yourself from yourself or anyone else. Even if that means expressing anger or sadness or fear. You might be trying to find a way to be both the mother and the lover. Or the father and the friend. <clears throat> you might be trying to find a way to be the healer and the vulnerable one. Who needs healing, love and support too, despite all your strength? This might also be an issue that is reflected in your physical world. Perhaps you are trying to decide on relationship issues, issues such as whether to proceed into marriage or are wondering how to build a better relationship with yourself. Perhaps you are trying to bring your head and heart together so that your life feels aligned and moving in the one direction rather than feeling pulled apart by compelling demands on your time and energy. Our Lady of Sacred Union shows up when we are working on finding a way through opposition and disharmony and into integration and functional behavior. Conflict can be an essential aspect of growth, like friction that causes sparks and fuels the fire of transformation. Our challenges can fire us up and give us the impetus we need to take action and be bold. Or sometimes they can wear us down and lead us into emotional fatigue and depression. 
particularly if we feel that the challenge has been continuing on for far too long without respite or relief. No matter whether we are on fire with a passion for finding a solution or drained and exhausted and needing the tender nourishing grace of heaven to inspire us with the solution that we have not as yet been able to find. Our Lady is here to help. This is also, I offer extensions already at Vimeo, so help you understand a little bit more of the background of Divine Masculine for this week. And I've got all the extensions up for you and be doing the New Year's Eve ones very soon. So subscribe to my channel, Receptive Mode for Twin Flames. Also, I've got the communion up there for Christmas on Holy, Holy, Holy. There are my two other channels on Vimeo where I'm actually, um, when you can't buy me here, I'm either there or with my clients. So it seems that Divine Masculine is going through growth, um, grief, I mean, loss. And that's helping him realign within. And we're feeling it as a Divine Feminine. This might also be an issue that is reflected in your physical world. Our Lady of Sacred Union shows up when we are working on finding a way through opposition and disharmony and into integration and functional behaviour. So, there's a solution that you have not yet seen. She asks you not to worry about one choice or another or to make space in your heart for a third option, another perspective, another way to be with this issue. Oh, but to make space in your heart for a third option, another perspective, another way to be with this issue. She says that there is always another way to be, no matter how set in stone your situation or issue may appear to be. There is always another way, another perspective, another path through the issue into resolution. Allow her to bless you with her guiding hand now, as she shows you the other way through into harmony going to guide you through this affirmation and healing process then I'm going to do a snapshot with the Lucy Cavendish another message from Mother Mary <clears throat> and see what flower he'd like to offer his divine feminine this Christmas you are standing with a beautiful tall and powerful woman who is holding a golden scale on each side of the scale you see each of the pairs of opposites it might be two choices that you are considering, two options in life, two ways to go, two relationships, the evil twin or the good twin, <coughs> or career paths, or it might not be that obvious to you what the choices are. It might be more a sense of not knowing exactly which way to go in your relationship or career, or how to proceed to heal a health or financial issue, for example. Eventually your attention moves away from the two sides of the scale and rests at the center of the scale. Where there is a white rose blooming with a diamond in its center. As you gaze at that rose and diamond, it spins, creating a field of light. That light now pierces into your mind and heart. It cleanses and opens your mind and heart to new possibilities, a transcendent choice. You don't have to understand it, just allow it with trust. When you are ready, say the following healing affirmation three times aloud if possible, or repeat it quietly in your mind. Let's do it together. The Lady of Unconditional Love, Our Lady of Sacred Union, Mother Mary, now reveals the transcendent choice, the third way in the perfect time. She blesses me with understanding and brings the angels to assist me now. I celebrate her with thanks. Blessings to the Holy Mother. The Lady of Unconditional Love, Our Lady of Sacred Union, Mother Mary, reveals a transcendent choice, the third way in the perfect time. She blesses me with understanding and brings the angels to assist me now. I celebrate her with thanks. Blessings to the Holy Mother. 
the Lady of Unconditional Love, Our Lady of Sacred Union, Mother Mary, reveals the transcendent choice, the third way, in the perfect time. She blesses me with understanding and brings the angels to assist me now. I celebrate her with thanks, blessings to the Holy Mother. So it's not this way or that way, it's thus way. So there's another option being revealed to you, Divine Masculine, to help you through this time. Let's just do a snapshot for this week, the Divine Masculine Stargate. Let's just have a look what he would like to tell his Divine Feminine. What's his message? What's he saying to his Divine Feminine about his 3D activities or life or heart? Anything he would like to let her know. Snapshot for this week from the Divine Masculine Collective overseen by Archangel Michael and Jesus, of course. Place that there. Just going to do a three pile, like three cards. I had the sun and the moon. <laughs> Just saw the sun and the moon. Oh, there's the sun. Okay, so a seven card layout means past, present, future. This is the um, energy around or the person. So this is Divine Masculine in the middle. And hopes and fears and the outcome. Mm. So he's taking a cut in money here. But we'll get the unexpected gift back. It's like halfway through, you go with your heart. He goes with his heart. I'm going to talk to you as your divine masculine, okay? So there's been something that you've decided even three days ago. It was very exciting. The wheel started turning. <coughs> you got everything in motion and you got single and independent here, right? Everything started to happen really well. And the Ace of Wands is the fire in your belly to get this going. Inspiration and action. This is coming up the same. And then there's an unexpected revelation that it takes your power. It's not a heartache. It's a power ache. <laughs> so, <clears throat> so let's have a look at what that is. See, well, this is where we are. We're in our power center, in our confidence, as our self-esteem. Do I deserve to have heartbreak? Do I deserve to miss out? Am I going to ignore my heart for power and money? Or am I going to go with my passion and independence? So let's have a look. What's the Three of Swords doing here? It's just my worst card ever. I'm just going to get some clarity on it for you. Thank you for being here. I wanted to thank you for supporting my channel all this year and all your donations and for helping me at Vimeo. It's taking off really well. Got a lot of support there, so thank you as well. I love doing the Vimeo channel because this is more broad and that's really for people who are interested in energy, who are really in the mission and who are, um, you know, awakened to a lot of things. So that's why we have the Holy Spirit there and I can talk more deeply about what God says. So Divine Masculine, you've met your counterpart, right, who makes you feel calm. And now you've got to um, kill the ego. <laughs> I was just saying that. Oh. So this, huh, Three of Swords, Right, the Three of Swords is a, an epiphany, right, like this person was ripping me off the whole time, right? Look at that, it's a Three of Swords for Divine Masculine. This is the Devil, the Tower, and the um, Five of Swords. So this is like, no, this person did not have my back. This is like finding out that the money has been siphoned out of the bank account, and you are trusting your intuition now. Right? You're not being a pushover. Right? Even though this is unrevealed, you're going to find it. So this is something that's unrevealed. You find out right, because of your intuitive guidance that you know is there because it just keeps yelling at you. It doesn't stop. And this is you going, right, you are dealing with somebody who's very narrow-minded and has beliefs of there is not enough for everybody and has siphoned either money, energy or time from you. However, you're awakened to this 
and it's just a process of this fire through the flame eclipse is going to ignite your power to get you out and the wheel of fortunes here because you're screaming for independence maybe you're just staying there for christmas or whatever but you're realizing nothing is more important than your happiness you can't buy peace of mind i'm getting a message for divine masculine of twin flames for stargate and flame eclipse going into the end of the year december 31st from mother mary and we have the crystals here that we're going to get a flower message from divine masculine to his beloved so that's what he wants to tell you that he's um there's been unexpected revelations that have slowed down the process of his confidence and power, right? which is understandable at this time. So we are the diamonds of God. right? So we're valuing our self-worth. The blue royal codes have come down and are being accessed by the twin flames. So your royalty of Gaia has so come to save her. So there's a message here to stay sober. My clear mind is easily able to focus and concentrate. Stay sober, divine masculine. No more numbing, self-medicating. The other message here is have faith. We had as much faith as, the, as a mustard seed. We could move a mountain, Jesus says. It's like, ah, oh, well, I don't really have any. So, I have faith in God to heal this situation. Hand it over and you go free. I cast this burden on the Christ within and I go free. And then you'll be able to have healthy communication with your heart in relationships. Sobriety, stay sober. Have faith in God. Not in the matrix, not in your bank account, not in your mother. I don't read it the other day start shuffling we know him very well and he said let's see what your mother thinks of you it's like oh my gosh no we're doing a love reading Tala heart to heart discussions and clear assertive communication help you understand and be understood All right so clear communication in relationships so you don't want to go on your date and go, hang on a minute, I'm just going to see what my mum thinks of you, or me, or it. It's like, no, no. So that's not a dream flame. So this might be something like that, breaking away from a family member, like your mother, had a lot of problems this week, <coughs> with a mother-son relationship. So you are spiritually protected. This is Kyrite, spiritual protection here. Right, so know you're spiritually protected and that we chose this. You are being watched over and protected physically, emotionally and energetically. And your heart is leading the way. So your heart's like defrosting. right? And it's going to start taking over the whole show. So Ruby's here. And it says, reach out for emotional and spiritual support to heal and mend your heart. Because we've got love addiction with our parents and narcissistic abuse. It's dysfunctional, that's why I'm saying it. It's you're clearing that and bringing something down soberly. <laughs> and Apophyllite is the Reiki crystal that we use in our distance healing. And that brings you in increased support from the collective. Your positive focus and willingness to receive have opened the doorway to an abundance of help and opportunities. And this is who you ask your father in heaven so this is about your lesson to look up and most people won't ask God right until you're really bad until you're on your knees you last and then you go excuse me I step out of the way and surrender any need for control in order to make room for God's healing love to flow through me and this situation I love that so who do you have faith in God and who did he send Jesus and what does Jesus do? He baptizes you with Holy Spirit and fire so that you can become the diamond that God created you to be. And that has a lot of self-worth. You are God's precious gem. And don't you forget it. 
Let me see again. Get a flower. Here we have, oh, and we've got a message here. All right. We've got Archangel Michael here. So let's do that quickly. A message, divine, feminine, divine, masculine, and the outcome for um, this week from Archangel Michael. Now he's our um, protector. He's our um, doorman. He's our security guard. But like any doorman, you have to ask him. So he's saying he will help you with the money to pay the mortgage, the rent, or your taxes. So we say thank you in advance and then relax. And any ideas that you need to help create that will come to you easily and effortlessly. So Archangel Michael and Jesus, thank you for watching over my home and its inhabitants. I ask that you post guardian angels at each window and door, ensuring its security. Thank you for guiding my finances so that I can easily afford to pay my rent, mortgages and taxes. Okay, this is oh, Archangel Michael, message for divine feminine, being gentle with yourself knowing that the Lamb of God has paved the way for your sins. You've got to know that because then Satan has no power over you. Give your sins to Jesus and we're out. We have freedom, salvation. Archangel Michael, please guide me in treating myself with gentle, nurturing love in everything I think and speak and do. Help me know that I deserve this compassion. I release any feelings of guilt to you and Jesus so that I may experience lasting inner peace and this is divine masculine oh the tables are turning understanding that it's a thought creates the emotion creates the action so in any moment we can decide to be happy i've been working on that archangel michael and jesus my lord my savior thank you for helping me open my heart to happiness joy and bliss i am now willing to see all of the goodness in my life so there's a shift here for divine masculine through this flame eclipse so hold on and innocence again for both twins coming into alignment into your royal blue codes and letting all the past go so beautiful so this is an initiation the stargate and the flame eclipse are beside each other the two portals and it brings you back to your god-given innocence says dear god and archangel michael thank you for helping me see that all of your qualities of pure love and light are reflected within me and all others help me embrace my god-given innocence so that i may be at peace so twins really important to be a peaceful being because that's you're generating that vibration knowing that god's got your back god's paying your rent to just decide to be happy because this is our new um, currency, isn't it? Happiness. The Father says, if you can bring joy, love and light, I will buy everything for you. I will look after everything for you. If I can get a worm for the birds, how much more will I look after you? A flower from Divine Masculine to his beloved. This between Christmas and New Year week. What's his flower? Oh, he's got a new idea. Oh, he's decided to be happy. And he's going to grab an apple. <laughs> so, crab apple. Ding! New idea. Well, we might run under the covers and just hide from that. <laughs> I'm kidding. Your new idea is divinely guided and is meant to be shared with others. Continue to work on it. As you are on the right path now God told me he was going to give divine masculine a new idea and that was some time ago in the calendar Gregorian, Gregorian calendar but who's looking at time and space it's just an illusion from Lucifer we're getting ideas and having no money is not a problem having no ideas so this is his flower Grab an apple. <laughs> Crab apple. This card confirms that you're on the right track. That new project, your twin flame union that you've been thinking of is brilliant. And the angels want to see it become a reality. Please continue working on this wonderful union so that you can share its benefits with others. Your inspiration is sent to you from the angels 
Your only requirement is to trust in the guidance you receive. Keep moving in the direction that feels right in your heart. Trust and have faith in your feelings when they're aligned with your Creator. Set a schedule for completing this union in 3D. It can be helpful to share this plan with only trusted friends. Tell this person or friend your desired date of completion and ask him or her to hold you accountable. So we might just write that down. Dear Father God, in Jesus' name I pray that I can have a grab an animal and have a new idea union fusion by 31st. This way there's no room for procrastination. You've set a date and being urged to continue until you've finished or something better. We always put additional meanings. You have greatness within you that's trying to come out. Follow your guidance at every opportunity. Share your ideas and creations with your beloved and then with the world. The new idea is coming your way. It's divinely guided and it will start the supernatural processes unfolding in your life. Stay grounded, stay protected and know your God's diamond, his precious jewel. So talk to him daily and listen, listen as we align with our divine blueprint and step forward into a flame eclipse stargate Christ mass initiation for all star seeds. I love you. If I can help you in any way, I do attunements, healings, and psychic readings at reikibybella.com. You can get a free upgrade on your first reading with me. Go to psychic readings, free upgrade, and book in the calendar there. Or under any um, product, you can see your book in your own time zone. And or you can join me at Holy 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 and Vimeo and Receptive Mode. All your extensions are up. For December I've got more for New Year but there are at least eight snapshots there and they're very important messages timed very exquisitely just for you I love you thanks for watching comment and connect below it's been a really tough year and I want to thank you for your support and your light and let's shine ever so bright so our twins can find us and that we can get into our mission of aligning with unconditional love. I love you. Thanks for watching. Look me up. I'm at reikibybella.com. Bye for now.